Today, a historic raceway in Richmond County is getting a visit from North Carolina Governor Roy Cooper. Rockingham Speedway's operators just finished a $3.5 million repaving project, and they hope to bring NASCAR racing back to Rockingham. Queen City News reporter Brett Baldick joins us to explain what the governor hopes will be another Rockingham draw. Good morning, NY and Jason. Governor Roy Cooper is officially kicking off the North Carolina Moonshine and Motorsports Trail. Rockingham Speedway is technically the first stop on the statewide self-guided tour. Track leaders tell me this is another win for the facility after receiving $9 million from the state last year. The Rock hasn't looked like this in decades. A $3.5 million repave resulting in a racing surface that is as smooth as can be. But the work across the 250-acre facility is far from complete. For example, the Turn 2 grandstands are being torn down to make way for a sun deck. The list of improvements is a long and tedious one. After it sat dormant for so long and so many people came through and kind of took everything that was of value from it, the last two and a half, three years has been a labor of love for everybody involved. Side by side of the line! Everyone working at the track would love to see NASCAR come back with a finish like the final cup race in 2004. Track executives say they have had brief conversations with NASCAR and the ball is now in their court. Everywhere I go around town, it's, it's when's NASCAR coming back? When's NASCAR coming back? And the, the same answer I can always give them is, is we're doing everything we can because that's our number one goal. In the meantime, the goal is to show NASCAR that Richmond County is ready to race. A half mile track behind the backstretch will soon have 5,000 permanent seats. The first official race on this short track will be in October featuring a grassroots racing series. It's going to be a full on, you know, um, kind of mini Martinsville, if you will. The hope is the stands will be full, sending a strong message to NASCAR and other racing series. If you want racing back at Rockingham, we are doing everything we can to get it there. And we desperately need the support of all the fans to come out and enjoy an event. 1989 NASCAR Cup Series champion Rusty Wallace is scheduled to be at this afternoon's event with Governor Cooper. Wallace is Rockingham's current track record holder, so one of his old cars will also uh, naturally be on hand. Cool. And uh, obviously it's raining today, so he probably most likely will not be taking a lap around the track, hmm. but uh, maybe it'll dry up by then. Who knows? <laughs> this is a big day. So what other construction is set to be complete at the track? Yeah, so they're installing fiber, oct fiber optic cable right now for high-speed internet. They're also going to reinstall the safer barriers along the walls and put in new foam. And then they're also going to be lighting up the entire 250-acre facility this year, including the big and little track.